Hello, this is True with the Middle School Malcolm Broadcast Team. Today I'm here with Mr. Arnold from the Junior High Cross Country Team. Thanks for being here with us today. Yeah, thanks for having me, guys. Appreciate it. How's the team? How's the season been going so far? Uh, it's been a really good season. Um, one thing we're seeing, which we're supposed to see, is we're seeing the kids really progress every week uh, and getting better. That's kind of how practices are designed. We follow a system where we can see them improve every week, and we're starting to see some better times. Um, some personal bests at races, so that's exactly where we want to be. Do you coach both boys and girls? Yeah, so in junior high cross country, that we have the ability to have boys and girls run together. We practice together, um, and at the meets, many of the races for the junior high runners are with boys and girls together. Is there some sort of lettering system where you can letter and do something like that? In junior high, we don't necessarily have a lettering system, um, but we do have, we try to have competitions within our team. Um, that helps to fuel their, you know, desire to do better and also does help them to improve as a runner if they're competing against each other. So we, we have some uh, inner squad meets where we track that um, and we can kind of watch their improvement that way. How many runners do you guys have this year? We have 19 runners this year um, with one coach. Um, so it's a fairly big team compared to some of the past years. Um, and, you know, we're actually getting kind of close to a uh, similar size to what the high school is, so that's impressive to see. Do you have a type of varsity for the runners? There is no varsity, uh, but what I would say is as a seventh grader, you are out there running against other seventh graders, but there are also other eighth graders that you have to compete, uh, compete against. So it's not necessarily that eighth graders are varsity and the seventh graders are not but they do have uh, that competition. And then once they become eighth graders, they now kind of have an advantage of being the older athletes um, in the races. Do you think there's any two boy, or like a boy and a girl that you think we should interview next? Yeah, I would say for a boy, uh, Caden Robotham would be a great person to interview. And Jessica Sandell would be uh, also a, a good runner to have in one of your um, videos. Thanks for being today with me. Mr. Arnold, this has been True with the Middle School Malcolm Broadcast Team. Thanks for listening. Thanks for having me.